Hello everyone. It's Bathurst week, people. Get excited. Charlie, what do you mean by Bathurst Week? Well, my good friend, let me tell you. Bathurst Week is pretty much just the, the name of the week with the Bathurst race in it. It doesn't sound that intelligent when you say it like that. But nonetheless, the Bathurst 1000 is happening in real life this weekend, this Sunday. I'm excited for it. The whole of Australia is... That's not true. Like, most of Australia doesn't even follow motorsport. But if you follow motorsport in Australia, and this is kind of a big deal. And, and people can't wait, I can't wait. I'm getting hyped for it. I'm gonna bring the hype on my channel just to get me hyped. I mean, if it gets you guys hyped, then that's great. I get it, some of you are gonna watch it, some of you are not, but either way, let's have some fun with it. Be plenty of Bathurst content coming up on my channel this week. I'm even skipping words, that's how excited I am. I'm just kind of putting sentences together and just knocking words straight out of it. I'm like, don't. Anyway, what I thought I would do is that this coming Saturday, and I'll put the exact time up on my website, I'll put all the details up on my website, but I want to get the general gist of this out now. Uh, this is, I guess, an announcement video for the race itself. The race is going to be Bathurst 250, or one quarter Bathurst, or 25%, I don't know what I'm going to call it yet, but anyway, it's going to be about a quarter of the length of the real Bathurst 1000. If you don't know what the Bathurst 1000 is, uh, it, essentially it's one of the biggest motorsport events in Australia. It's using our local racing series, the Australian Supercars, and they do a bit, I mean, come on, you guys know what a Bathurst 1000 is, don't you? And anyway, it's coming out, if you don't know what a Bathurst 1000 is, like, what are you even doing here on this channel? Oh, well, if you're gonna be an asshole, I'm just gonna leave the... What a dick. Oh, sorry, we're still recording. So back to the race itself. How's it going to work? Well, the Bathurst 250, or whatever the hell I call this race, is going to be a quarter of the length of the real one, as I said. Now, the real one is 1,000 kilometers long. That's what the 1,000 is, by the way, if you weren't sure. It's 1,000 kilometers, which ends up being about 161 laps uh, and around about six hours or so to run. So by the time you divide that in four, you end up with a 38 lap race around about 250 kilometers and about 80 minutes long. Now, one of the other things I want to do, I really stumbled on the word long then. I was like, my brain must have been going, is that is that a dirty word? Can I say long? It's fine. Now, if you want to find out the specific details of the race and the rules, etc., and by the way, that does seem like a pretty intelligent thing to want to know, the best place to find it is going to be over on my website. The link will, of course, be down in the description, charlieroscoe.com. But I'll also give you a very quick verbal rundown of the rules now. The class is going to be GR3, it'll be a 38 lap race, it'll be a standing start followed by a rolling start, the balance of performance will be turned on, tuning prohibited, tyre wears 4 times, available tyres, racing medium, fuel burns 3 times, starting fuel's 100 litres, flag rules are on, as far as the assist go, you've got counter steering prohibited, you've got active stability management prohibited, TCS and ABS, however there is no limit at all. Anyway, something a little bit different, something I've never done before, uh, is try and run a team race. And that's what this is going to be. This is going to be a team race. So you and somebody else is going to be on a team. Well, there, hopefully there'll be multiple teams and not just like you and that one guy that you know that also plays Gran Turismo. Hopefully we can get a whole field of teams. And basically the way it's going to work is that person one, and you can nominate who you want to be person one, Person one is going to be in charge of qualifying. So you're going to want someone pretty quick that knows their way around the track to try and get you the best possible starting position. Uh, and then that person, whoever qualifies, has to start the race. We'll roll through. That's going to be the beginning of the race. Now, 13 laps into this race, it's going to stop and there is going to be a mandatory driver swap. Now, you know, you're probably asking how the hell do you do a driver swap in Gran Turismo, Charlie, you dickhead. Uh, well, the simple answer is you can't, so thanks Polyphony Digital for that. Uh, you can't even do qualifying, so we'll just make that up too. But what we're going to do is after 13 laps, uh, we're going to stop the race. So it's a standing start, race one's a standing start. We're going to stop the race. Uh, we are then going to, I'm actually going to open up our whole new lobby. And everyone's going to have to jump in. I will then stack them in the order that their teammate finished the last race. As soon as that is done, we will begin uh, the second half of the race, the post-driver swap portion of the race. And that is going to be 
the remaining 25 laps long. Uh, it'll be a rolling start and it'll be in the position that your first driver left off. So basically it's, in, it's an important role for the first driver because he has to qualify, he has to get off the start with a standing start uh, and he then has to get into the best position possible. As the second driver, uh, it'll be a rolling start, so it feels a little bit more like the actual race is continuing. Uh, a rolling start, so of course anyone that is a lap down or whatever, unlapped yourself. I'm not going to be making people sit on the start finish line for a lap. I'm not a total asshole. Yeah, you are. Shut up. But that is pretty much how it's going to work. The time is going to be on Saturday. Saturday night Australian time. I'm thinking around about 7 p.m., 7.30 p.m., somewhere there, uh, which I think is about 10 a.m., 10.30 a.m. in... Uh, the UK and Europe but of course all the details are going to be posted on my website as I said earlier I just really wanted to get this announcement video out so that you guys had a chance to hear what was going on get the general gist of it uh, I don't have long to organize this so people are going to need to sign up basically now if you know someone uh, that you can go with straight away you can just nominate the two of you that's cool it will be a first in best dress kind of basis once we hit maximum amount of people um then i'll just have to start sort of saying sorry but no uh, now if you want to participate and you don't have a particular friend or someone you know and by the way organize this on discord for sure just hit each other up on my discord if you're on that uh, and try and pair up but if you can't still put your name down as a single driver and, and i'll just help match you Basically, we'll just pick someone out so that you guys can can have a bit of fun. If you've been around my YouTube channel before, you know that it's plagued with technical difficulties. So why not try and choose one of the most technically difficult races that I could come up with uh, using Gran Turismo? It seems like the logical thing to do. That's what I've done. I think it's going to be a blast. I look forward to talking to you throughout the week. There's going to be a live stream up on my channel. Uh, most likely tomorrow, maybe tomorrow and Thursday, maybe just Thursday. Who knows? Keep an eye out uh, for that if you haven't already hit the bell next to the subscribe button. I suggest you do that because they are like the only people on earth that actually get notified of my content. So if you want to see when things pop up, go and hit the bell. Do the lackey next to the thingy on the button and the thing and the subscribe. You know what you're doing. Hopefully we can get together this field. If we can't, if I can't get enough people, I most likely just want run one race, one lobby of about an hour, something like that. And we can at least have a bit of fun. Should be able to fill a lobby up there. Uh, but hopefully we can get the required amount of people, which is going to be like 28 or 30 or something like that. Well, with it, Willie and I will race together. Uh, so removing that, you've got about 30 people I think we need. So uh, we'll see how we go. But anyway, I've crapped on long enough. Thanks for watching. It's Bathurst week, people. It's Bathurst week. Goodbye for now. Oh, thank Christ. You shut up. You sound like a wanker, mate. What are you even doing in my house, mate? Who are you? It's time to come together. It's up to you.